Most of the time Sabaton stories comes from more recent times. We have been focusing a lot on World War II, World War I. Some of the reasons behind this is that we find more facts. It's easier to find and stay true to facts and we don't need to go to myths and legends and stories uh, that were never written down even. So going back in time to the time of uh, Swedish Empire was a bit challenging and uh, the facts so to say that we read about in uh, some of the books might not be true at all. We needed to find an historian to help us, to advise us with this job to do it properly. We found this guy Bengt Lillegren who wrote a book about the life of Carolus Rex and uh, he's also a musician himself so he had kind of a vision how how lyrics can fit into uh, music. So with the help of him we found the right topics to cover the, uh, the different eras of the Swedish Empire. He helped us find stories we would never find by ourselves and find the facts to back it up. The album Carolus Rex and the Swedish Empire spans over a time period of 100 years. For us there was a lot of things to cover in there so we needed to focus on a couple of things which makes more interesting stories to us. Obviously the life and death of Carolus Rex was for us one of the more interesting parts of this because he became like the lead character of this and he is also one of the main characters who defines the time of the Swedish Empire. Why we decided to focus the album of Carolus Rex has many reasons. He was a charismatic character, he was one of the defining characters of the time of the Swedish Empire and we also kind of think that he has a very very powerful type not just for himself but for our heavy metal album. There were several parts of his life that we find very interesting from the time when he was crowning himself to the time when he was killed somehow in Norway. If Carol Sex was murdered by his own ranks or by the enemy we don't know but we leave it up to the listener to decide the fate of Carol Sex.